Good morning and buenos dias. I am Abu Shaib and welcome back for another lesson in Puerto Rican expressions. Today I'm going to talk about traffic. As you come into San Juan, the first thing you will notice are the incredibly long lines of traffic. Car after car after car after car. It's often said that there are more cars than people here in Puerto Rico and it's probably literally true by two or three times, especially if you count all the junkers that are lying around. So first of all, I'm going to go over some vocabulary words for vehicles that you find on the street. A couple that just occurred to me, and we'll pretend that they're written right here above, are roller skates. Roller skates in standard Spanish are los, patin, los patines, los patines, the skates. A skateboard would be una patineta, a skateboard, una patineta. This also includes when it has a handlebar on it, which we would say scooter in English. In Puerto Rican Spanish, we call it una patineta. Anyways, bicycle, we mostly use the word, the formal Spanish word, la bicicleta, la bicicleta, here in Puerto Rico. Kids will say la bici for short. Motorcycle, motorcycle, we always use the formal here in Puerto Rico, la motorra, la motorra. In most other countries, they use the abbreviated form and they say la moto because it was made famous from a song from the early 80s, a pop song, subi a mi moto. Here in Puerto Rico, any SUV, pickup truck, van, hatchback, school bus is una guagua or una guaguita, the diminutive form. Guaguita specifically refers to station wagons and hatchbacks. Even if it's a small hatchback, if it's got a hatchback, it's una guaguita in Puerto Rico. Car is el carro. In formal Spanish, it's el coche or el auto. El automóvil, also in written Spanish. Truck. Here in Puerto Rico is el troc. This is Spanglish. The plural is los troces, the trucks, los troces. Truck in standard Spanish is el camino. Traffic, traffic, traffic. Traffic is el tráfico, el tránsito is transit. We use both of these words in the same way that we do in English. Calle, la calle, the street. I live on 21st Street. Yo vivo en la calle 21. Yo vivo en la calle 21. I live on 21st Street. Road, El Camino, the Chevy product, El Camino. The road runner, beep, beep, El Corre Caminos, run road, Corre Caminos. Highway, highway here in Puerto Rico is usually La Carretera. In formal Spanish, it's also El Autopista. When I was first struggling with Spanish, I often mispronounced this word and accidentally said cartera instead of carretera, which means wallet or purse here in Puerto Rico, which led to some uncomfortable misunderstandings. Exit. Exit is la salida. Turn only lane is el solo. Solo is only, in this case, it can also mean alone, solo. Yo fui allí solo. I went there alone. Yo fui allí solo. Toll booth. Toll booth, which we have quite a few here in Puerto Rico, is el peaje, el peaje. To pass through the toll booth, you have to buy a card, una tarjeta, a card, at Public Works, Obras Públicas, Public Works, Obras Públicas, and this scans you as you pass through the toll booth, peaje. I believe it's $1.75 for a car now. I'm not sure. I don't go through the toll booth regularly. Speed bump. We have a lot of speed bumps here, especially in residential areas, to control speeding. Speed bump is el muerto, the dead man. El muerto, los muertos, speed bumps. Muchos, muchos muertos para allí. There's, there's a lot of speed bumps over there. Stop sign here in Puerto Rico is el parre, el parre. Parre, in other countries, it's el alto. Parre is what's written on the, on the stop signs here in Puerto Rico, and Mexico is alto. Traffic light, which I'm dressed like a traffic light for this video, I have on yellow socks and green shoes. Traffic light is a semáforo, but we generally say the light, la luz, in la luz, at the light, in la luz. Sign, here in Puerto Rico, is el rotulo. In other countries, they favor the word el letrero. Both of these are formal Spanish, it's just preference. Here's rotulo. Miles, we don't really use the metric system very often here in Puerto Rico. Miles are millas, las millas. There are certain signs, algunos rotulos, some signs here in Puerto Rico, aquí en Puerto Rico, that have a, the signs that tell the distance between towns here in Puerto Rico, give the distance in, in metric, give it in kilometers. Nobody really understands why or pays much attention to this. It's just kind of an idiosyncrasy. 
um, some directions to the left, to the right, to the right, a la derecha, to the left, a la izquierda. These are feminine because it refers to the hand, a la mano derecha, the hand, la mano, although it ends in an O, is a feminine word. The definite article is la, and all adjectives are feminine. La mano derecha, la mano cansada, is the tired hand. But the directions come from the hand, so it's la, la izquierda, a la izquierda, to the right, a la, or to the left, a la derecha, to the right, excuse me. Straight ahead is al der, derecho, al derecho, al. A-L, not E-L. Al derecho, too straight. We also say directo. Sigilo directo, go straight. Sigilo directo, go straight. Car problem. Car problem is generally said una falla. Tiene una falla, it has a problem. Tiene una falla in el motor. It has a problem in the engine. A breakdown in standard Spanish is avería. Una avería, but we don't use that word here in Puerto Rico. I don't know about other countries. Here in Puerto Rico, a word we use a lot is el choque, the accident. There are unfortunately quite a few accidents here in the, in the highway, so be careful if you drive in Puerto Rico. Choque, un choque. Yo vi un choque, un choque. Yo vi un choque. I saw an accident, I saw an accident. Traffic jam, which you will also experience if you drive in Puerto Rico in almost any town, especially when school is starting or school lets out. Most parents drive their kids to school here. Um, traffic jam is el tapón. In other countries, they say other names. This is proper Spanish. It's, el tapón is a clog or a, a stopper in a bottle. In some other countries, they might use more formal words or literature, embotamiento. But here in Puerto Rico, traffic jam is el tapón. And they can be horrendous. You can be stuck in for an hour in traffic here without going anywhere especially if there's an accident, un choque. Tow truck is una grua, la grua. This means crane, because of the crane that pulls up the car. Rain, which often affects driving conditions here, is la lluvia. When you say it's raining, you say está lloviendo. You don't say está lloviendo, as many beginners do. The verb is llover. It's raining, está lloviendo, está lloviendo. And it is raining today. Slippery, resbaloso. This is kind of colloquial. Ca uh, camino resbaloso, slippery road. Cuando mojado, when wet. Cuando mojado, camino, road, slippery road. Slippery in formal Spanish is resbaladizo, but it's only used in technical literature. Like a, a slippery surface would be una superficie resbaladiza in standard American Spanish. Taxi stand. Taxi stand is el, the terminal, el terminal. This is a place where you can find public taxis, which are usually passenger vans that go between the towns here in Puerto Rico. They can be reasonably priced, but if there's not a lot of customers, if there's not a lot of passengers, they might try and take advantage of the situation and you might have to negotiate the price and contract the driver privately. The ferry. There are ferries both from the the west side of the island that go between the Dominican Republic and Puerto Rico, and here in my town in Fajardo that go between the two other populated islands to the east of Puerto Rico that are Puerto Rico as well. The two populated islands to the east of Puerto Rico are Culebra y Vieques, and they're great tourist destinations. I really recommend them if you come to Puerto Rico. You can take the ferry down here at the, that's also called El Terminal de Ferry. Well, I hope you learned some highway and traffic words. Thank you very much for viewing. Have a great day.